Okay, we're going to test a set of two fours. That's all it says is two times 400. Do not call or email. Want to know what the secret number was? We don't know. These are off old two four setups back on the super, you know, the muscle car days. First of all, you need four, uh, three pounds pressure on the fuel gauge. Some people put one regulator per carburetor. We don't think that's necessary, but anyway, if you got more than four pounds pressure of fuel going in here, it will not function properly. Do not call us. Do not email us to ask us why. It's flooding all over the place. Now, this carburetor will run by itself. You can block one off, put a plate in there just to scare people with, or you can run it by itself. I mean, you can run it simultaneously, or you can run it with progressive linkage. This one here has no choke. This is computing now the amount of air fuel ratio going out the exhaust system in this entire engine through that carburetor. That's what it's calculating. That says it's about 13 parts of uh, air to one part of gas. Now you hear them back barrels kick in. Now that'll come back and it'll neutralize about 12 and a half or 13. You adjust your mixtures right here to get that to this air fuel ratio system. Or you can get the motor BM on a tachometer and leave it right there. No choke. Choke the room. Carburetor run by itself, 400 CFM, got a four and a half inch diameter top. You can get a fitting that'll turn it into a five inch top, is what they use now, five and an eight. Or you can leave it four and a half, that's what they used to be. These were like on 409s and Mopars and Ram intakes and one behind the other, Chrysler, Hemis, all of them. But these are 400 CFM. In a minute, we're going to show you the other. This one has a vacuum port for a uh, distributor if you need it, and it's got a PVC valve or the brakes, whichever one you want to use it. It's a good carburetor, and it's done. Carburetor number two of the 2 4 setup. Remember, three pounds of fuel pressure. Don't call up if you put more than there. Listen to your high and neighbors. It's already set up to run about 12 and a half, 13 parts, like we told you. Got the best idle speed. This one here does not have a fitting for your brakes. It's off the other carburetor. However, this one's got a choke. You can put a cable to it and choke it. You got another place you can put a fitting for your windshield wipers or whatever. Now, like my my uh, 27 year old son says, Dad, don't forget to tell them eBay, eBay guys that no, you don't get the motor. No, you don't get the fuel pump. No, you don't get all this test equipment. No, you don't get all the gauges. You don't get our garage. You get two carburetors. Some of those eBay guys, they'll want to know, do you get the shoes? Do you get that guy's shirt? I'm telling you, this carburetor run by itself, four and a half inch top. It'll run with another thing to make it a five inch. It'll run by itself, or it'll run in conjunction with the other one. And as you see, it's a perfect running unit, comes right back to 12 to 13 parts. Ready to go and scare all the neighbors. Good unit, good set. Happy days ahead.